Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is in ScreenFlow 9. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create this scrolling text that you see below the video of me and my buddy Gary V. Let me show you how to do it in ScreenFlow 9. So this is what we're going to be creating. That scrolling text that you see below Gary V. The black shape layer on the bottom is an annotation. Then I have some text layers that I copied and paste. And to make the text scroll, you're going to use a video action. So the document settings I used was just a 1080p preset, which is 1920 by 1080 pixels, 30 frames per second. Let's first create the text box. For that, you're going to use an annotation. So come up here to the inspector panel, click on the pencil icon, click on the little plus symbol here, select the second one, solid fill rectangle, click on the color swatch to give it a color. I just used all black. You'll see your cursor turns into this little crosshair. Just come over here to the edge. I'm going to drag out a shape from edge to edge. I'm going to lower the opacity to 75%. I'm going to click on the timeline to commit the changes. And I can just drag it out to any duration that I need. Now it's time to add some text. Come up to the inspector panel. Click on the T. Click on the plus. Add the text that you want. I don't want this black backdrop, so I'm going to uncheck the box for backdrop. Select the font. Give it a size. I created a style preset, so I'm going to click on this cube, select my preset. The font I'm using is SF Pro Display, and the size is 46. So I have the annotation layer on the bottom set to 75% opacity. I have a text layer on top of that. I'm just going to drag this out a little bit. So I'm just going to drag it to 16 seconds. And now we're going to animate the text across the bottom. To do that, we're going to use a video action. With the text layer selected, come up to the inspector panel. You want the video properties. Click on the plus action button. You'll see this little yellow bar comes onto the clip. When it's in yellow, that means that whatever you do next is going to be animated. So all we're going to do is drag this text, which is currently off the canvas, and drag it all the way across. So I'm just going to click. I'm going to drag it across. I'm going to use the smart guides when I end just to make sure that it ends right across the middle so it stays straight. Now if I come back to the beginning, you can see it's going to animate across way too fast. So we're going to click on this action and drag it out. And I found that 12 seconds work good. I'm going to hit the space bar and there is your scrolling text across the bottom. And now all you need to do is copy and paste the text layers so you can get the timing the way you want it. So maybe when this one's here, you want another one trailing behind. I'll select the clip and copy, Command C, Command V to paste. So you'll see here, if I go back here, as this one gets here, another one's coming behind. Command C, Command V, this one gets here. We have another one coming behind. We'll set this one here, Command V, you see, you can just leapfrog as long as you need. You can change out the text at any time. Just double click in there if you want to change it. Maybe just subscribe to your channel. And if you look at Gary V's video here, he's got these two boxes here, the scrolling text. He's got a logo in the top right corner. No problem. You can create an annotation here. I've got these two little boxes so you can just drop in video. I've got a backdrop with a lowered opacity, a logo in the top, and I've got the scrolling text going across the bottom. And one little bonus tip. You'll see that the text is really bright white. You might want that, but it might also be a little distracting. So just select any text layer, come up to the opacity, and type in 75%. Now you've got this kind of little gray that just gives a little more subtle effect. My name is Mike Murphy. That is how you create scrolling text across the bottom in ScreenFlow 9. Cheers.